This is Shelley Kraft. We're coming to you live on SNN Live. We're at the NEBA conference here in New Orleans 2012. Theo Sherman of EDIS, a private company. Theo, I want to welcome you to SNN Live. Thank Thanks, Shelley. So let's get right into it. Give me the lowdown on EDIS. Well, EDIS is going to do for education what um, Google's done for information. Simple as that. And Twitter's done for communication. Uh, EDIS has developed the world's first multi dimensional intelligent teaching assistant where it'll take 65 percent of a teacher's workload away getting a teacher back to focusing on individualized teaching uh, we developed a system that can sh identify what a child's missed throughout the entire learning career build a learning plan incorporate their learning style and their foundational level of knowledge and then go through the system and teach them whatever they've missed is this oriented towards a public school private school or independent learning Good question. Uh, all schools. So we, we've run, the, we're running this, and we've, this got, we've got this in over 3,500 schools uh, in five continents uh, that's running the system. Uh, big private the districts at private schools and so forth. There's no limitation. It goes to any K-12 educational schooling system. And we have parents putting it in home. We have homeschoolers using it for the same reason. That's what I was thinking. So what is the basis of which you can gain the knowledge of where a student needs help. Yeah. We build an algorithm that starts with an assessment. We will run an assessment. Uh, we'll take a, let's say, grade 9 student, look at uh, the entire learning career, run an assessment. And we can identify that a grade 9 student is struggling because they missed a simple concept like common denominators in grade 3. Build a learning plan to then bring that student back to proficiency. And the system will then systematically work through all those key points until they become proficient. So this, the algorithm does that. In the, in the software. So this is remedial. Uh, without a doubt, it's remedial uh, intervention. Uh, we, uh, we have homeschooling parents using it for gifted students where they want to work them ahead. So therefore they can work them ahead by determining what they need to know in the future and then putting that into their learning solution. Uh, uh, that's exactly right. Our schooling system needs to change. Currently our schooling system is one teacher standing in front of a group of students uh, and that teacher is driving the learning plan for that group of students. Uh, they all have different needs. So what we need is run individualized assessments, identify what every one of those individual students know and each of them should have their own learning environment and each of them should learn at their own pace. So suddenly we taking the walls out of schools from a grade level point of view as well as a knowledge point of view. Well, I also think in my own assessment that you're giving the student an opportunity to have his own homeschool situation by having your software on their own home computer. And now, you know, the, you could start to turn education into sort of a game in a way. That's un the technology takes any of those, the, the, those learning and temperament uh, issues away. Uh, you're right. The student can access it from any terminal, anywhere, as they run through the whole process. Uh, and it, it, like I said, removes the walls. The learning becomes 24-7, and the child now can now drive that learning process. We're not dependent on the teacher, uh, and the teacher is overwhelmed anyway. Now, this is a product that has to be purchased by the school system. Is it affordable? That, that's the unique thing. What we've done is we've combined a range of different uh, models, including corporates putting it in schools at the corporate cost. We saw that in Japan where the corporates are involved with schooling and it's not all on the school shoulders or on the principal shoulders. So we bring the corporate in saying we can now get value for our money investment in driving education going forward. What's your background? Uh, engineering degree and a teaching degree. That's good. So where did you grow up? South Africa. So that's where the funny accent comes from. English is my second language. I'm an ESL learner myself. Well, my English is my second language also. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Theo Sherman Edus, spelled E-D-U-S-S, -S, and your website is? E-D-U-S-S dot com. We're keeping it simple. Ladies and gentlemen, Theo Sherman, thank you again for coming on to SNN Live. Thank you very much.